Hi, it's Deanna from Futures Past Boutique here on Long Island, and today I'm going to show you an early 20th century Persian export story bracelet. And it comes in its original presentation box, which was handmade out of wood, and the top slides off like a pencil case. Somebody had written in pencil some information about it. It's hard to make out because it's very faded. And um, it says, only place in world this is done. So I guess this was explaining more about the story bracelet. And on the side, it has like an old price about, I think it says 35.0 reals. So I guess that was the currency, the real. And uh, so I'm going to show you it. Let me slide the top off a moment. Bear with me. And um, each panel has a story and has almost like an illustration um, showing you Islamic art. It's made um, out of mother of pearl and lacquer. So it was hand painted and lacquered by hand. And each panel is placed on silver. It is tarnished and I'm gonna try to clean it and take the tarnish off. And let me take it out and show it to you. So on the back, it's uh, you can see the mother of pearl panels. It does have Islamic writing. And you can see it's like hinged. Each uh, panel has hinged uh, little uh, pieces of silver to hold them together, but yet they can like flex and bend um, so the person can wear it. Let me just take it out a moment and let me show you. So as you can see, it has a nice iridescence quality to it. So it's iridescent when you hold it in certain light. And it has like what appears to be some battle scenes. Let me try to zoom in on them so you can see them better. It's a lot of men on horseback. My cell phone is not very good at focusing. Um, I used to get really good macro shots from it, but lately it's been really, really faltering. It's time for a new cell phone. I mean, it is old, not as old as an antique, but it's getting there. So, yeah, so I thought this box was interesting because um, you can see all the tool marks. It was like all handmade. The box, you know, itself in itself is like pretty interesting. And this is probably like 1920 around there. That's my guess. The catch has like a little heart on it. And uh, the funny part is I tried to sell, the, you know, list this on Etsy for sale. And Etsy keeps um, kicking back a message to me st stating that um, I, can, I cannot list it because there's sanctions on Iran right now. And even though it's an antique, for some reason their bots are kicking it out and telling me um, to please um, read the rules and regulations of listing certain things on Etsy. And hey, look, our president has to do what he has to do in order to protect us. And uh, so I'm not mad. Um, I think I'll just keep it and the heck with it. It's not worth the heck of a lot of money. So I guess it's uh, here to stay. And uh, I thought you guys would be interested in seeing it. So once again, thanks for watching another one of my videos. If you like what you see, hit the thumbs up and subscribe. And stay tuned in because I'll be uh, uploading more videos showing you interesting and unique historical pieces of art and uh, objects. Have a great day.